Hello YouTube, my name is Manuel and in today's video I will see what my teacher gave me for my grade versus what I actually got in my exam for my grade. And we're gonna start right here. So here I think we can see our credit- whoa, okay, it's already- we're just in- okay. So my credit- okay, this is- okay. Let's see. So, for Russian, <laughs> I got a H1. 96% was my teachers and then they rounded it down and they moved it down to 94%. Uh, for music, I got a H3, 79%. That's just a heat. That's I don't understand. And they kept that 79%. Then my business was at 74. They round. They went up. My teacher. Okay, um, that's pretty good. For physics. Uh, H3, I got 71, and they decided to lift me higher. This is funny. Applied maths, I got 77. They decided to lose two marks. That's okay. Okay, uh, French, yeah, they decided to lower me, but okay. Maths uh, was 63. They decided to also lower me. Almost too far. <laughs> uh, English, I got 60% by my teacher. Wait, wait, let me see this. My teacher gave me 60%, well, they gave me 58. 60? Wait, what? Wait, what? Wait, so my teacher gave me 60%. But they put me down to 58? What? Oh, it's the other way around. Wait, wait, wait. So, my teacher gave me 94%, but my actual grade was 96 for Russian, 79 for music, and then 79 for music. My business teacher gave me 74.1, and I got 74. Uh, my physics teacher gave me 71.65, and I got 71. My applied math teacher gave me 75, and I got 77. 58 for French, 59. Almost got a, almost got a H4, but that doesn't matter. I'm shocked a little bit, but we'll get to it in a second. Maths, I got a 61 from my teacher and 63 is what they gave me. Um, my teacher for English gave me 58. That is not okay. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. I'm shocked. I think I could have had less points. Well, luckily I didn't. Wow. That's, that, 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 that's kind of scary. Okay, and in Irish, I got 66.8, and my credit grade, a credit degree was 69. Let's see what my written grades were. <laughs> to the bottom. Okay. What? I actually got a H1 in Russian? Ah! <laughs> Yo. Nice. Music, I actually got a H3. Failed business and applied maths. But in maths I got... This, this is scary. This is very scary. Did I really do that bad? I don't know what to say. But we don't talk about... Oh, there's no... Did I actually do that bad? I mean, it kind of makes sense. I ne like I don't really learn stuff. Like in class, oh wow, that's that's ooh. that's scary. It's quite scary. Something just I don't know what happened on the day. It didn't feel that bad. This is I, I, I'm shocked. I didn't. I didn't think I could do that bad in business. Like, there's no point appeal. Like, there's no point reviewing it because I have my course and stuff. But it just, it just kind of feels bad to not know if I actually did that bad or if it was a correct mistake. It could be either. Wow. 
<laughs> I, I wasn't expecting this to fail. Like, I failed applied maths. And business... Is, is that... It isn't a fail for business, but... It's very disappointing. Well, it doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. Whatever happened here, happened. I did sit five subjects. Uh, because physics, French, and... Irish. Irish was ordinary level. No point sitting that. I have nine subjects in total. All of them are higher level except Irish. English, I wasn't gonna... I was deaf. I, I don't know if I would have gotten a higher grade or not. Maths. Um, I obviously sat maths because I didn't put in a lot of work during the time of education. And I thought I could do better, but obviously I couldn't. Um, but still, so I got 63%. 440 is the maximum points, and I received calculator, maths. Uh, so 279 divided by 440, 63 uh, so 63%. Huh? Okay, so I did do better. Than my teacher predicted. Uh, let's see what else. Uh, business. <laughs> Music. So 308. So out of how many? Let's see. Music. 400. So I got... That's 308 out of 400. 77%. My teacher thought I would get... 79 okay okay th that's pretty nice <laughs> uh russian i got 94 according to my teacher what i actually got is 376 so 376 divided by 400 divided by 400 i'm so confused how are they so accurate what my teacher predicted my exact grade and she predicted it correctly that's mad Psh, my teacher's a genius that, that's pretty cool like that's a flex that that's a flex wow that this is strange i i was not expecting failing business and applied maths Appl applied math failing apply <sighs> that's scary to be honest, I have not put in enough work into applied maths throughout the year. It, it was just too hard for me. But that bad? Really? I don't know. I'm going to apply to review maths because it's no effort. Okay. So I'll be able to view my script. That could be another video. <laughs> it could be. So that's it. Uh, wow. I was I really was not expecting to fail business. Everyone thinks I'm good at business. But it seems that I'm... I don't know. I don't know what happens. I thought I would not fail. Bit. Like, failing business wasn't even an option. But I managed to fail business. That, that's strange. I, I don't know. Yeah. I'm shocked. Failing business and applied maths. Well, okay, I didn't fail business, but I basically failed business. Applied maths. I failed applied maths. I failed applied maths. No one saw that coming. No one. No one, yet yeah, no one. My classmates, they, like if I say that I failed applied maths, they're not gonna believe me because that's, yeah, <laughs> I don't know, I'm gonna, ask my classmates what they got for their results because that's a little bit interesting how did i manage to fail applied maths in business i was not exceptional in music yet i managed to get a h3 in music and i taught that applied maths was easy i believed that applied maths was easy how <laughs> it, it doesn't matter it doesn't matter but it's, it's a bit painful. A little bit painful, but... 
these are the final grades. I have done well. I've gotten a course in a very nice university, college. And I'm happy. I'll have to sort out transportation, but yeah, I'm like, I got a course in, a, in one of the top colleges of Ireland. So I'm glad for that. Uh, that that's it for this video. I will go contemplate life about business and applied maths. I hope you weren't as shocked as I was with my results. I've had pretty good results and awful results, but the awful results definitely have a stronger feeling in my heart. Yeah, it's a little bit sad, but it doesn't matter. We still managed to secure a very nice course in a very nice college. I hope you were also able to sort out something in the end. My friend, I'm pretty sure he still didn't get a place, but hopefully round two comes and he'll be able to get a place. I hope you best of luck with round two and to get a course that you will enjoy studying. If you'd like to check out more SEC videos, you can check them out right here. There's probably two videos. And I will also be soon making a video applying to Trinity. I've recorded most of it. I still haven't fully applied because their system was slightly down. I'm waiting for it to be up. So I'll finish editing this video. Hopefully I won't be editing until midnight again because I need my sleep. I'll do my application tomorrow. So hopefully there'll be another video coming out tomorrow about my application to Trinity. Maybe. I don't know. I hope you enjoyed this video and goodbye.